Hello guys, today I am going to show you how to generate police siren with triple five IC. So let's get started. For the police siren, we need two number of triple five IC and both are operated in a stable mode. Pin. 4 and 8 goes to plus VCC and I am applying 5 volt. So power section part is completed. Pin number 7, 6 and 2. In a stable mode, we know always pin number 6 and 2 both are connected together. Here also, one resistor between pin number 7 and plus VCC is connected and the value is 10 kilo ohms. In between pin number 7 and 6 we need one potentiometer and the middle pin of the potentiometer is connected here. Ok. Then one capacitor is connected and it is connected to ground. The value is 20 nanofarad and here the potentiometer value is 100 kilo ohms. Now after completing this now come to this IC. Here is pin number 7 one resistor is connected between pin number 7 and plus VCC. The value is 5.6 kilo ohms. One potentiometer is connected between pin number 7 and 6 and 2. One end of the potentiometer is connected to pin number 7 and then the middle pin is connected to pin number 6. Then one capacitor is connected and then it is connected to ground. The value is 47 microfarad. This side is positive and this side is negative. Ok. And the potentiometer value is 50 kilo ohms. Now come to pin number 5 of first IC. We have to connect one resistor. The value is 2.2 kilo ohms. Here plus VCC. And another resistor is connected here. Ok. The value is 4.7 kilo ohms. Then this both connected to a transistor and these both are connected to emitter of the transistor this is PNP transistor and you can use any PNP transistor I am using BC558 ok the base of the transistor is connected here then the collector goes to ground ok here is our output pin number 3 and we have to connect our speaker in this output. Before that we have to connect one capacitor. Then it goes to speaker. And other pin of the speaker goes to ground. The value is 100 microfarad. So this is everything about the circuit. Now let's see this on the breadboard. Put the triple five IC then connect pin number 4 to plus VCC also the pin number 8 pin number 1 goes to ground 10 kilo ohm resistor is connected between pin number 7 and plus VCC this is our first triple 5 this one the second one first I will complete this connection then I will come to this here is here is 100 kilo ohms potentiometer one end of the potentiometer is connected to pin number 7 the middle pin of the potentiometer is connected to pin number 2 here we need 20 nanofarad capacitance so what I will do is I will connect 10 nanofarad capacitor here is also 10 nanofarad capacitor and I will connect both of them in parallel so its equivalent capacitance will be 20 nanofarad. 10 nanofarad capacitor is 103 or you can say 0 0.01 microfarad. It is 103 picofarad. Ok. 10 zero and 3 zeros picofarad. Now connect two of them in parallel. Ok. Now one end is connected to ground 
and other side is connected to pin number 2 pin number 6 and 2 both are connected together now we have to complete this IC connection 0 0.01 microfarad capacitor is connected to pin number 5 of second IC then other end of the capacitor is connected to ground 5.6 kilo ohm resistor is connected between pin number 7 and plus VCC here is our 50 kilo ohms potentiometer one end of the potentiometer is connected to pin number 7 the middle pin of the potentiometer is connected to pin number 2 pin number 6 and 2 both are connected together 47 microfarad capacitor is connected to pin number 2 and then it is connected to ground the positive lead is connected to pin number 2 and the negative is connected to ground after completing this now connect the transistor this will connect both the IC collector of the transistor is connected to ground base is connected to pin number 6 and 2 I am connecting it to pin number 6 because both pins are connected 4.7 kilo ohm resistor is connected between emitter and plus VCC another resistor that is the 2.2 kilo ohm resistor is connected between pin number 5 of first IC and emitter of the transistor so I am connecting the resistor to pin number 5 of first IC ok 100 microfarad capacitor is connected to pin number 3 of first IC its positive lead is connected to pin number 3 here is our speaker one pin of the speaker is connected to ground the other pin is connected to negative pin of the capacitor connect both the positive rail both the negative rail so this is how we have completed our connections now connect the power supply here is negative here is our positive I think the sound is not good so what you do is here in the speaker before the speaker just connect one resistor ok and the value is minimum resistance it's like 10 ohms ok it will rectify our problem ok now see this on the breadboard I'm talking about this connection just remove it and connect a 10 ohm resistor with the capacitor then connect it now connect the power supply it is better than before ok now see this this potentiometer is for increasing the period the time period it is longer see now time period is reduced ok I am keeping like this and this one for the sound frequency so I think this is perfect so guys this is all for today I hope you like this video if so then please like share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any doubt on this then please let me know in the comment section in the next video I'll show you another topic till then stay happy and I'll see you in the next video thanks for watching